In new at seven, Van Buren County Courts has moved to stream its hearings during the stay at home order, letting people participate remotely. News 8's Kyle Mitchell gives us a look at how technology is now changing their operations. Van Buren County Courts has been looking at expanding video conferencing for months. The COVID-19 pandemic moved up the timetable. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Mr. Jenkins, anything you wish to say? The future of court hearings may be mostly outside the courtroom itself. We're doing what everyone else is doing. We're looking at creative ways to provide access remotely. Chief Judge Kathleen Brickley of the Van Buren County Court spoke with us using the Zoom video conferencing service. We're conducting all essential hearings and we're conducting all non-essential hearings that we can do remotely. Uh, the exception to that is we are not doing jury trials uh, because of social distancing. While some question the legality of this, most counties have been conducting video arraignments from jails for years. And Chief Judge Brickley says the courts have the legal right to expand the use for other hearings. We're governed still and guided by the court rule. Uh, by the Supreme Court as well as the Supreme Court's orders as they've been coming out through this crisis and very timely, I should mention. We're trying to think outside the box. Trial court administrator Frank Hardister says the technology has a variety of uses. Court employees can watch the hearings from home and print documents to the courthouse for judges to sign. There's a number of things that are happening obviously behind the scenes to help those cases move along, whether it's our probation officers that are, that are meeting with their, their respective clients remotely, or if it's our uh, treatment court caseworkers. With the courthouse temporarily closed to the public, Van Buren County is streaming hearings on YouTube. Now, have you been to prison before? So in the past, maybe we've had a defendant or uh, one witness appear by video. Now it's an expansion where the defendant, the plaintiff, the attorneys, uh, you name it, uh, they're now all appearing by video, and we may have only one person in our courtroom uh, recording the proceeding. A technology that is forever changing how courtrooms operate. Zoom is being provided at no cost. There was an initial cost of $3,500 to integrate streaming with the court recording system, but there is an overall savings because it reduces prisoner transport time. In the Kalamazoo studio, Kyle Mitchell, News 8.